Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. Remembering 41. It's like president. Like that. President, good job. <laughs> and then Bush, you just spell his name. President Bush, B-U-S-H. Spending much of her childhood years here on Guam, Heather Zimmerman, a proud graduate from the GED program at the Guam Community College, is now pursuing a PhD in the nation's capital. Proficient in sign language, she was tapped to be an interpreter at Wednesday's funeral of the late President Bush Sr. I was pretty young when um, President Bush was in power, um, but I, it's, it's an honor to get to be a part of history. History in the making, Zimmerman reflects on the legacy of the late president who in July 1990 signed a piece of legislation meant to increase equal access for Americans with disabilities. His history is kind of controversial, like some people really love him and other people um, wish he could have done more. But he did amazing things for people with disabilities. And because of the American with Disabilities Act, a lot of people have been able to go to college to, to find access and employment. And access to equal opportunity she's eager to provide for Guam residents. Because our island is so much about inclusivity and about cherishing each other for who they are and family, you know? And if we really want to take that heart to the next level and include this whole act of American with Disabilities Act, which applies to Guam law, and, and honor our values and our tradition, then why doesn't everybody learn sign language? Why don't we teach it in school? Zimmerman stays in touch with friends and family on island, hoping that with the proper direction, Guam can be a leader in accessibility and inclusion. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Carmen Victoria Terlahi. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.